Now I'm going to make some apple and blackberry short crust tarts. For this recipe, the ingredients you'll need are very few. First of all, a ready rolled just roll short crust sheet, a couple of dessert apples, some fresh blackberries, some demerara sugar, and finally, to give the pastry a little gleam, some beaten whole egg. The first one we use is a just roll, ready rolled short crust sheet. You just cut the sheet into four equal rectangles, very simply like that. And then place the pieces of pastry onto a lined baking tin. Now I'm using a lined tin because I'm using sugar and fruit and when they boil out, which sometimes they do do, it tends to stick to the tin. However, if you don't want to line the tin, that's really not a problem. And then I'm going to use some eating apples or dessert apples. No need to skin them at all because that adds to the flavour, keeps in the vitamins and also looks much prettier. Cut them in half and then in quarters and remove the core and then cut them into dice, just like that, or cubes. So all we do is scatter over some of the apple onto each of the pastry pieces, making sure that you leave a border of pastry around the edge. This is vital because that's going to form the sides of the tart. And then pop on four to five blackberries, depending upon how big they are, on how many you have to start with, on each of the tarts. Right, so they all look generously topped. And then just pop that out of the way. And now I'm going to brush the borders of the pastry with a little beaten whole egg. Or you can use milk or indeed even water. You do have to brush the borders with something moist because I'm going to pinch up the pastry and it's got to have some moisture to stick to itself. So having brushed the borders, you now lift up the pastry just like this with no special method other than pinching it up onto itself. So that you're making a little wall round the outside of each of these tartlets. And the reason I've used whole egg is because in a minute I'm going to brush the outside of these tarts with that egg and that gives a really nice golden sheeny golden brown colour. But as I said earlier, if you only use water or indeed milk then you can use that to brush the outside with. So that's the edges nicely turned up, made into tarts. A quick whiz round with the beaten egg which will give it a nice sheen when we're cooking it. And being short crust pastry, I'm cooking it at 200 degrees centigrade or 180 if you have a fan oven or gas mark six. Then the final touch before it goes into the oven is a sprinkling of demerara sugar. Just a small sprinkling, otherwise the fruit will catch and burn. And then when the tarts come out of the oven, you give it a final sprinkling. And of course, if you like, you can add cinnamon to the sugar. So there they are, ready to go into the oven. And here are the blackberry and apple short crust tarts. And to finish off, a final sprinkle with a little bit more demerara sugar. Mm.